Welcome to Safety Minute. I'm Officer Chris Bianas with the Plano Police Department's Crime Prevention Unit, where we provide education to increase the safety for people and their property. Halloween does not have to be scary. Here are some great tips from the American Academy of Pediatrics to help your kids have fun and stay safe on Halloween. Many parents worry about the safety of the candy their children bring back. It's very unlikely that the candy will pose any direct risk to your kids or that it's been tampered with, but it's always a great idea to know what your kids are going to be eating. If it's something you do not want your kids to have, such as something with a choking hazard, take it out and discard it. Also, help your kids not devour everything the first night by rationing the candy. Two greater risks to your kids are costumes and cars on the street. It's important that your kids not have impeded vision while they are out moving about. So be really careful about masks, eye patches, and hats. When it comes to costumes, make sure everything a child wears is flame retardant. No part of the costume should hang low enough to cause a tripping hazard or come in contact with a flame. Kids running across the street at night can be very dangerous. So make sure costumes have reflective material. If not, consider adding reflective tape so vehicles can easily see them. Everyone who's walking around should have a working flashlight with fresh batteries. Make sure that children understand not to cross the street without their chaperone. To get our home ready for trick-or-treaters, here are some suggestions. Remove anything someone could trip over, such as bikes, garden hoses, or lawn decorations. Have porch lights on and replace any burned out bulbs. Wet leaves should be swept away from the steps and sidewalks. Restrain pets to avoid them from jumping on or biting a trick-or-treater. On behalf of the Plano Police Department, we hope you have a fun and safe Halloween. In our next session, we need to revisit our most frequent property crime. My name is Chris Bianas. Thank you for tuning in.